guys welcome i'm tracy this is my channel tracy from the mermaid cove i'm here i am wearing this mermaid top that angela loves is my mermaid necklace angela was really the head mermaid but um i'm going there now it's sunday morning say my last goodbye though i feel like she's probably not there anymore but she's free but uh yeah so not the mother's day i intended to have the plans they make plans right um, so, yeah, I'm going to post some stuff today that I've already filmed. I just wanted to say hi to everyone and thank you for your support. And, um, you know, the pain's unbearable, but you know, I know I'm not alone. And that's a gift. That's truly a gift. We just seem to can't avoid pain, right? But suffering, I don't know. But I took a long walk in the rain yesterday because I thought my chest hurt so bad like I was doing like that I took a nice long walk and uh, I need to do that all the time it really does it helped my chest feel so much better and I ran into one of the first things I saw was a mermaid bath for birds so yeah it's a tough one and I know how many people are suffering and uh, or have loved ones who are suffering so you know, there's no right or wrong way to do anything. It's just, um, you know, be as present as you can. But I think today I'm going to come home. I do want to grab, if it's not raining, some, some tree limbs to put into a bag. And then just maybe rest, do some art, watch what I want to watch. Um, I've taken off Monday and Tuesday just to have, um, yeah, time. You know, sometimes when you go to work, you know, you have to behave in a certain way. And, um, or so they tell me, <laughs> but yeah, I just don't feel like doing that. So, and if Tuesday, I feel like it was a bad idea, I'll go to work. You know, sometimes too much time alone. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, this too shall pass. Honestly, I'm going to get a tattoo. This too shall pass. Of course, it flies for, applies for good things too. But <clears throat> yeah. So just, uh, yeah, I didn't want to disappear because I was planning on posting yesterday. And, you know, I had some stuff I wanted to do for you guys. But it's another day coming up soon. And, um, but yeah, so thanks again. And I'm not sure what content I'm going to show, but I'm cleaning out my phones. There might be something there that I did a while ago. But uh, yeah, so uh, lots of love. And thank you for your support. I'm Tracy from the Mermaid Code. Okay, guys, welcome. I'm Tracy. This is my channel, Tracy from the Mermaid Co. We do a little bit of everything, especially Trader Joe's, all these grocery hauls, recipes that I'm getting back into that, all kinds of stuff. Because like I said, it's just really not, I'm not the best Trader Joe's hauler or that's this, I'm just the best me. So, um, and that's doubtful some days. So welcome to my world, to my life. And uh, I love sharing with you guys and hearing your comments. Please subscribe, like, and leave a comment. Very much appreciated it. Appreciated it. Anyway, got lights. So I'm trying to work on my lighting next. We'll see. But I don't know if you guys can see. Like, I wear my mask super tight because if your mask is comfortable, you're not wearing it correctly. And I just, I don't want to get it. So I get like all kinds, like my nose got, it's like it cracked. And around my mouth, there's always something going on. It is not easy. Trader Joe's, there's a miracle, y'all. Can you see it? 49.05. I'm doing my best. That was a miracle. So, I've got to pick a budget and then, you know, stick to it. Instead of just trying to do better, right? Okay. I need a sip of my shake. Excuse me. I'm going to have to say this before I start. Um, there is my Aldi haul video. 
it looks like I have some kind of crazy chin hair. Now, I couldn't sleep. I, I, don't, I just haven't slept in six weeks because of my friend being sick. And it's, <clears throat> excuse me, showing up on my face. <clears throat> anyway, I woke up in the middle of the night, was looking at it, and I thought, what on earth? Like, what happened? I go in the bathroom, I got like a flat, I got everything. Like, I don't have that. I thought, what is going on? And you know what? It, it shouldn't matter, but it does. I would like, I am on top of my chin hair. It's my nephew's job when I'm old, too old to do it. But apparently, you just don't care. I don't know. So, I thought, what was going on? What was happening? It was so bizarre. And I remembered. I've been speaking to my mother and asking her for a sign. And um, this caught my attention. So this is like a bookmark. And on the back, this was the first feather she sent me. Oh my God, it's like falling apart. And I taped, I can let that go because it's not my mother. But I taped it and somehow one flew up to my chin and stayed there. You guys. There's a sign. That's my mother. 100% my mother. I love that. And I know I need to lean into it and relax that whether I have an obvious sign or not that I am with, she's with me. It's just really tough right now with my friend. Just, you know, it's just hard. And my life's changed. My best friend's life has changed. Her, you know, my friend's life has changed. People helping. It's just so hard. And, um, Yeah. But let's do something fun because I do have fun talking to you and I have fun at the Trader Joe's. So, I'm going to tell you right now, I bought the Coffee Blast ice cream. I returned. Yes, I did. I'm, I'm returning, girl. Barbara told me I wanted to return and I have. So, I returned the um, Oat Okie Dokie Non-Dairy. It was $3.99. I did not enjoy it. It was super sweet. I don't know. And there was these tortilla chips, which I'm going to post on my Instagram, were gross because I wouldn't even share them with anyone. So, there was $2.49. Right there was $6. Um, but I did buy chocolate hold the comb, which is at work. And I did buy um, coffee ice cream. Now, I can't eat coffee ice cream at home at late because they'll keep me up. And at work, I can have like a scoop and be fine. Where at home, it bothers me. So, that's, that's why that's there. I got the spiral zucchini, which I just didn't think I had room in my fridge. So I'll bring that home one night when I'm going to eat it. And I got vegetable pad thai. That's $3.49. Spiral zucchini is $2.99 in the frozen department. Um, hold the cone, $3.29. Y'all know who know. Yes, so good. Um, and the coffee blast is $3.29. This big, so much better than the okie dokie artichokey stuff. So... Yeah, that is how that worked out. So the pad thai is really good too. You just microwave it right on point. All right, one lemon, one lime, 49 cents. I think this was um, 49 and 29.49. So I'm tired of buying them, not using them. Um, this is, see, there's a feather. <laughs> wow, okay. I don't know, it make salmon, Mexican food, but I'm gonna be using those. I just gotta cut down how much I buy of stuff. I love the pepperoni. So 329, I'm getting low for my pizzas and stuff. I got some cherry tomatoes. I like the ones that have different ones, but it's so much bigger and more expensive. So these are, uh, I don't know, I wrote this down. Three. 29 organic cherry tomatoes. I've been loving those. Unexpected cheddar top 10, y'all. Top 10. Top 10. And I know I've been just buying blocks of cheese and grating my own because it's so much better. They, whatever they put in to keep the cheese from sticking, you don't, you don't need that in your body. So it's $8.99 a pound. This is $4.58. I'm never, oh my God, not running out of that. So I'm going to try different sparkling waters. Like I said, this is 33.8 ounces, 79 cents. Because a lot of times when I open, let me grab one to show you what I'm talking about. <clears throat> a 
A lot of times I can't drink this whole thing. I can't drink it at one setting because of my stomach. I love the bubbly and the Waterloo. So this is 12 ounces, right? Um, so I'm going to try and see if those flavors are so good. But I got to figure out like some way to, I guess I need to get a thing to put it in that keeps it fizzy so I can have it when I come home at night. This is also a big, this is just, yeah, I'm just going to try it. Not today. Um, Trader Joe's Organic Sparkling Lemon Strawberry Apple Cider Beverage. $1.69. We'll see. 35 calories. Have y'all had it? I mean, I can't do kombucha stuff, but I thought, all right, let's try this since it's different. Okay, you guys. Let me go grab this real quick. Okay, so this is new, new, $4.49, which is maybe a little pricey, right? I mean, you probably have everything you need at home because you have to add egg, butter, milk, egg, butter, milk, right? So now the thing with these things is I saw them on another um, Hauler's channel, her and her husband, they didn't like them, but they looked anemic. You know what I mean? Like pale. You have to zhuzh these up. 100%. So I had some real blueberries. I put in a, a little bit in the mix and I stuck them in because they explode. And when you bite into here, you're going to get that real blueberry taste and it's good. And then I put a little bit of um, the cane sugar, raw sugar, um, to give it, I don't know, it's a crunch, right? It's just, and it browns it up beautifully. So I made these for my friend Angela and her, some of her caretakers, right? And um, for one of my friends, just um, gave me some casserole. It was so good. So I want to give her one. And um, I'm not sure who else is special enough to get one of my muffins. Cindy, Sandy, Michelle, you would definitely rate. But you have the nerve not to be around. Okay. Other thing, and I'll probably have this for breakfast tomorrow, is the cocoa and sea salt naturally flavored instant oatmeal. I haven't eaten oatmeal in a while. My friend loves it. She gave me this one, which is Nature's Path Blueberry Cinnamon Flax. And then in French, too. So I have that to try. Trader Joe's used to have the best blueberry um, oatmeal a long time ago. So we'll see. You know, you just nuke it. Maybe I can, I can have breakfast for lunch, too. Um, I'm out of oat milk, so I'll have to wait. But yeah. So I'll let you know how that is. I'll do a posting either on another channel, another thing, or on my Instagram, which is Tracy from the Monday Cope. Come check me out. Say hi. Any questions, you can DM me there. Okay. Watching all these lunches and these moms, it's always moms, putting together their kids' lunch and trying to you have a mixture. You get a sweet, you get a vegetable, you get a chip, you get a main course, you get maybe a napkin, maybe a nice little note. So I'm trying to do this for myself. So these are veggie crisp puffed potato snacks flavored with spinach and tomato. Again, it's got that oil in it that people don't like. Okay, but no weird coloring. Y'all. Those are good. So different. Two twenty nine. Yum. Okay. I like that. And you feel like you're eating a vegetable. <laughs> Not really. I'm trying so hard to like vegetables. It's not that I hate them. If I came home and someone made me a beautiful vegetable dish, I would eat it. I'm just not good at cooking it. I don't know. I've been craving fruit punch, y'all. I I think from seeing these like lunch hauls. So I got a fruit punch, like it wasn't too bad. I mean, the one that I used to have as a kid, like the punch, fruit punch, um, is full of crap. So I might break down one day. I wish I could find it in a bottle, but organic fruit punch, flavored juice beverage blended from concentrate. You get eight pouches for three, I want to say 99. And I've had one. I haven't had these. Remind me, of course, of Capri Sun. I haven't had one of these since, I don't know. But I put it at work. I put it in the freezer and get it like slushy. I could not make, I could not make this thing open. I had to cut it, put my straw in, no shame, but so 
So I'm on a fruit punch kick to try different fruit punch things. But not quite what I had in my mind, but they're good. And it's just something different from my little lunchbox. All right. Like I said, I did not get that much. Two taste tests. I'm going to save the one I'm really excited about for last. I'm not thinking, I'm, I don't know why I got these. Peanut butter cocoa marshmallows. But I will have, do a taste test with my friends from my mom's recipe box. They need to we, call me and make an appointment so we can do this. But I have to hunt them down. I'm the one that works all the time, so my schedule's. Yeah, you know, it's all booked up with work. But it's cocoa marshmallows and a peanut butter coating with a chocolatey drizzle. So I'm sure there's, oh my God, there's palm kernel oil. Wow, see, I have really got in the store to read these things and not just, oh, it's new, grab it. No, I don't want palm, anyway. Let's see. I know they're going to be super sweet. I mean, it's a marshmallow. I do still want to make them. They were $3.99, Barb. I promise you I'm going to make them. So funny. Like, how big is this bag? And look at that. Like, crazy. Okay. All right. Cocoa marshmallows. Okay. Peanut butter marshmallow. 100% peanut butter, the star of this show. You know what I think these would be really good? Is cut them up, make Rice Krispies. You could do that yummy um, Rice Krispies. How is it? Reese's, the one, little balls. But do your regular marshmallow and then cut these up and stick them in towards the end. You all. I'm gonna do that because I'm probably gonna put this in hot chocolate. But I bet that would be so good, so different, right? They're good though. And this is the thing I was so excited to get: Trader Joe's Bomba Puffed Peanut and Corn Snacks Dipped in Dark Chocolate. But y'all, I misread it. This is two ninety nine. I'll be sharing this. I'm going to one of my friends had me over from a dinner, birthday dinner. I'm gonna have this with them. Actually, let me open the one that there's no price on. And then I'm going to bag up some of this for a couple of people I know to try. I love the new ones that are hazelnut in the middle. They're perfect. They are perfect. And I honestly have to control myself. So these are not them. I thought it was those with chocolate on them, dark chocolate, because you can't have everything. Anyway, this is just one of the plain ones with chocolate. Okay. No, oh, I was really thinking it was the other one. Okay. I would never buy them again because I want the other ones. But I will share them and see what people think. A couple different people to share them with. Um, Cindy Michelle, I'll send some to you. Sandy's getting a bag. Yeah, it's a little bit. The wind's taken out of my sails a little bit. And then I'm paying attention. There's no palm oil, but there's sunflower oil. Okay. All right. <sighs> Seriously, I can't be disappointed by a Trader Joe's snack, can I? And I'm revisiting this because I'm desperate. It's okay. It's good. I mean, throwing that stuff I got from Aldi's, which I've already given away. Um, it's going to do me till I, y'all, I'm going to have everyone I know that goes to Trader Joe's be on the hunt for that. And I want four bags, but I'll probably have them give me two bags. Because uh, I don't, I think they last long enough, but this production thing is truly something. It is. Like, you couldn't find saltines, you couldn't find Philadelphia che cream cheese. I mean, salads, the produce was just ridiculous. So you never know, but hey, I can live without popcorn if I have to, right? I mean, this panic. I just, I choose not to accept it, not to, I don't watch the news. I got so wound up that first year. I swear to you, I'm losing hair. And I know it's just the stress of these two years and the three years and my friend and I don't, I have thick hair. I had thick hair. I'm telling you right now, I don't have as thick of hair. And I'm having some kind of breakdown because I was trying to do the gray thing. But when I look in the mirror, sometimes I just feel so ugly. I do. And that's a mean thing to say to yourself. 
but I think I have to go get some heavy blonde highlights. I think what I'm going to do is I always like did the roots, the dark color, but I'm going to let that go. And then just, you know, but I got to, I, that and my skin, my nails are a mess. I got to get, yeah. These are things that will make me feel happier. You know, everything that's external. Okay. Thanks for watching. Let me know what are you excited about at the Trader Joe's? What of this are you going to try? I mean, I don't think I would like peanut butter in my hot chocolate, but I think those Rice Krispie Treats, or I don't know, a kid might like just one or two as a snack. It's a little sweet for me to eat that way. Um, I'm excited about these. You guys, have you tried them? I was looking for carrot chips, but I couldn't find them. So I'm going to try, you know, get away from like potato chips, that kind of thing. God forbid, truffle anything. I'm not getting it. I know the big game. I'm filming when the big game. Oh, I know. One more thing. Um, I'm filming when the game is. I don't know when it starts, but it's five o'clock. My mother, it was thing. We had, we had the um, usually chicken wings, macaroni and cheese. She'd make some kind of dessert. It was a thing. But I just don't even know it exists anymore. I okay. Organic mayonnaise. I was at my friend's. I needed mayonnaise. I wasn't going anywhere, so I grabbed this organic sea. Soybean oil. That seems not good. Other than that, okay. And I don't remember what it cost. Like three something? I don't think it was cheap because it's organic. It's very vinegary, very lemony to me. I would not buy it again. I'm going to figure out a way to use it because it was expensive and I, I'm just using this stuff up. So maybe I'm going to make some tuna salad. So maybe I'll put it in my tuna salad or if I make a um, casserole or something. Yeah, I'm feeling the need for a casserole. So if you get these, and I think you should though, probably just as easy. Oops. Um, Zhuzhum. Zhuzhum, 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 or they will not, they'll be like um, anemic. Yeah. Okay, guys, thanks. Let me know what's going on. Um, yeah, so I'm not sure what I'm going to post this because I've been posting a lot because I've had people ask me to. Thank you very much that you care and you, you share that with me. It's so nice. I My friends, Beverly does never, hardly watches me. So, and my family, well, they just don't. They've had enough of me. <laughs> Apparently... A lifetime has gone a long way, but I appreciate you guys so much. Bless you for everything. And those of you who click and comment and like and subscribe, it means everything. So namaste and I will see you soon.